Last one. So stoked to have this one. Had the set as a kid. I believe I had all six poses. Second reclaimed uh, Mark's six inch astronaut. There's our correct stampage on the bottom. And four more to go. And I got out all my other larger uh, figures here just to show that I got them. Uh, there's a Glencoe reissue, an Ajax guy, I believe he's Archer, and for the record, these things piss me off, because it's almost impossible to know whether they're originals or, or not. Uh, here's a, a trio of, to me, posed uh, astronauts, and then these three, which I, four, I mean, which I used to believe were by Marks, I'm now pretty sure they're by MPC, um, and these probably are as well, uh, my marvelous Russian cosmonaut from Elena, thank you so much again, my dear, and that interesting fireman, and then these two Japanese soldiers, which uh, came in a lot, I think, maybe, the, couple of those and, and the blue guy were in a lot with these Japanese soldiers. I thought I was going to get rid of them. He's missing his samurai sword. Um, but there's something cool about him. Very interesting forms. I think they're by Marx. And, and of course these two are. And had the set as a kid. Um... Some of them were cut from their bases. I did awful things to my toys when I was a child. I don't think I ever lit them on fire or anything like that, but they definitely, they didn't survive. And at some point, um, my parents ruthlessly divested of all of it with both the garbage can and the Salvation Army as likely destinations. Um, they're not in the house anymore. Searched endlessly. Anyway, I've got two of them back. Four more to go. And they'll join some good company of a larger Spaceman forms. And, you know, okay, I don't mean to be mean. I, there's just no way to know. It, the, the, the gray guy is by Glencoe, 1990s reproduction. That was identified as, as likely a 1950s archer. And he's definitely... This one here, uh, because of that patent pending, he's almost certainly an archer. I'm sorry, this is Ajax. He's archer. And it's just too confusing. Um, the forms really don't do much for me. I shouldn't, I shouldn't just say anything. Because they're part of the idiom. And you got you got to have a few examples. And I think those are enough for me. Um, I, I, I just want my astronauts. Although not necessarily NASA centric. How about that? They have the same head, by the way. That's one thing that's weird about them. I should have gotten out some smaller ones, too, because they were cast in two different sizes. But that's the same guy's head. Used it for all the different poses. Uh, it looks like it might be slight, a different facial expression. Um, but somebody pointed that out that they're all like clones. And it's kind of creepy. And that makes him even more cool. All right.